Hi, to maximize battery life on your Poco S6, as a first step, go in the settings and here find the lock screen tab. So, here firstly we we'll need to take a look at the slip section and we got here a few options but to save the battery power we would need to select one of these two options 15 seconds or 30 seconds so this means that your screen will turn off after 15 or 30 seconds of inactivity and this feature will be really helpful if you just forget to turn off your phone so it will turn off by itself and save the battery power which is pretty cool now after that, go in the wallpaper carousel and here disable this show wallpaper carousel on lock screen. So this means you'll disable automatic wallpaper change. If you have this feature enabled, your phone constantly connects to the internet to update the wallpaper. Just turn it off and save the power. So here, let's just tap no thanks. And now this feature is disabled like that. Here, also disable this update wallpapers using mobile data. Just like this, great. Now, we would need to go in the main settings and select notifications and status bar. Here, just turn off notifications from unnecessary apps. In this section, find apps that you rarely use and turn off notifications for them. This will reduce battery consumption. So here just disable some of the apps by tapping on the switcher like that and you can do just the same for the floating notifications and for the badges. Just go in the app notifications by itself and disable some of the notifications here. For example, let's select Amazon shopping by tapping on the switcher like that. Great! And after that, go in the display brightness. And here, turn on the screen dark mode. So in the screen and brightness settings, just turn on the dark mode. And also manual brightness control helps a lot. Just make it brighter during the day and darker at night. And then scroll a bit so you can see the refresh rate here. If you have custom like I do, then in the section refresh rate, you need to switch from 120 to 60 Hz. This will significantly reduce power consumption. And if you had the default option, just go into custom and as I did before, select 60 Hz. Great. And now let's go back and select AI image engine. And here in this super resolution, we would need to disable those not needed features to enhance videos and here we would need to disable this AI HDR enhancements as well. So this will help to save the battery power. And now as for the home screen, let's just find it in the settings here. Go in this first screen and here turn off Google screen. If you don't use it, just go to this setting and turn it off by enabling this none option. And now select sound and vibration and here turn off vibrations and system sounds. For that, just go in this section, disable those two features. Here also disable haptic feedback. And as for the sound effects here, you can also disable some of the features, then go in the additional settings and in the system sound, disable each of them like that by tapping on this switcher. And now, also to save the battery power, you can uninstall unnecessary apps. And for that, we would need to find this apps tab, go in the manage option and here, we can just select apps we want to uninstall by tapping this recycle bin. So just uninstall anything you don't use to save the battery and the memory. And also we can enable power saving mode. And for that, select the battery tab. And from the current mode, you can switch to battery saver. Here you'll see the remaining time and ultra battery saver. So it will increase the time which you can spend on your phone. So ultra battery saver restricts most power consuming features. So you'll see only a few apps on your screen, but you'll be able to add some as Google Chrome, for example. 
and after that also disable location services for that scroll to the location tab and here disable this fish reuse location and do just the same for location services and that's it for today i hope those advices helped and thank you for watching